Our program is really designed for people who are interested in healthcare research, health services research, health policy research, and understanding the outcomes or the consequences of different policies or how services are delivered. We teach the methods and skills to really answer those questions. I wanted to start seeing the answers to things that were really important to me that I didn't see yet, and that's why I decided to pursue a PhD. Being able to watch faculty as they work and getting to take over certain aspects of a project and having that autonomy, that is really empowering. Faculty and students will work together to develop an idea from a nagging question and take that concept, that idea, really further develop it, understand what data sources are available to answer that question, what methods we can use to answer that question, and ultimately where that fits in with the state of literature that has already been published on the topic. In my seminar course, we talk about teamwork and leadership. How do we study teamwork in healthcare? How do we study leadership? What topics are important? I definitely expanded my scope of knowledge related to healthcare systems and public health systems. And I now have a much better understanding of how the world of academia works which was not something that was familiar to me at all before coming into the program. You really get a sense of what it's like to be a day-to-day -day faculty member and researcher. So you have a sense of what it's like to organize or write a grant, what it's like to keep track of a team of researchers who are all working on a certain project, and what it's like to publish and maintain a high publishing record. Every single faculty member has had an open door policy, and I have taken advantage of that in almost every case. And that was really important to me. I've had the opportunity to work closely with several different faculty members. Um, with my primary mentor, I've been um, working on writing papers, and I've had the opportunity to sort of lead that paper as a first author. If you want to participate, if you want to gain experience in teaching, uh, there are plenty of opportunities available. I've been able to be a teaching assistant in several courses, and now I teach uh, a class on health IT management and policy. I needed to be in a program where I felt that I was going to be supported, and that there were people around me that were not going to let me fail, and that's what I found here.